Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of Stardew Valley. It looks like it's raining outside. Yeah, it is most definitely raining outside. I think that means that my plants are automatically watered for me. Uh, let's see, we've got some mail. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpacks. See you soon. Okay, well that's definitely a good thing. Also, I've noticed that in my crafting, I can now make a chest. Which will store 50... whatever. So, we'll just uh, throw those on the floor. And I'm gonna take that chest and place that guy down, um, maybe right there. Here? There we go. That looks good. And then I can put a bunch of this stuff in there, which I think is probably a good thing. That should open up some inventory space for us, which is awesome. So, we've still got a few people in the town that we need to talk to, uh, and we still have... Uh, some other things that we need to do as well, but we're making progress. We're getting we're getting there. Things are happening. I'd like to do a little bit of fishing today. I'd like to kind of try that out now that we have a little bit of inventory space and we might actually be able to sell some of that fish. Um, let's stop at Pierre's real quick. I just want to see... Well, actually, are they open? Closed on Wednesdays. Okay, so he's actually closed today. So he sent me an advertisement saying, Stop by today... And then he's not even open. That seems like poor advertising to me. I mean, I'm no expert. Don't get me wrong. I'm no expert. But that doesn't seem like the best use of uh, advertising time, if you ask me. What's this? Uh, let's see. Hmm. With 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. Okay. So if I gather enough wood, we can fix that up. That's locked. And then this was, um, Willie's, the, uh, the fisherman guy. This was his over here. So I think, I think we'll try out a little bit of fishing. We'll see how this works. Okay. So, we throw it in there. Can I pull it back? I can. And I can throw it, like, way out. And we'll see if we can catch anything. Oh, okay, so you click to hit. Click to raise the bar. Keep the bar behind the fish. Okay, and you can just hold mouse down. Oh, oh. There we go. What do we catch? A five-inch sunfish. Okay, that's not terrible, I think. I don't know. I mean, that seems... I don't know. I'm guessing that the, uh, the old rod here won't be able to catch... Anything suit? Oh, I lost it. Fishing's actually kind of challenging. It's a little... Like, it takes some getting used to. Let's see here. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Got it? I'm assuming that the bigger the fish... Oh, no! No, no, no! Ah! I'm really bad at fishing. <laughs> I'm really bad at fishing. This is kind of terrible. We'll try it once more, and then we'll see if we can sell whatever we caught. Let's see. Yeah, the fishing is actually pretty challenging, I must say. It's hard to get the mouse to kind of... Like, it's not intu... It, well, I shouldn't say it's not intuitive. It's, um... Got it. Oh, yep. Yeah. Almost. Oh, no, 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 no. Stay, fishy. No, 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 don't break. Don't break. Stay, no. Almost. I'm trying to th figure out if the fish, like, gets tired after some time. Oh, almost. Oh, we almost got him. Oh, stop moving. Stop moving. No, 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 no. There, it seems like he gets tired after a while. Oh, almost. There we go, we got him. What did we get? A one-inch sardine. Maybe that's... Oh, no, I, I, I want to go in, in here. There we go. All right, let's try seeing... We can sell the sunfish for 30 and the sardine for 40. Let's do that. We can use the money. 
The bamboo pole, I think, is the next one, and I'm assuming it can catch bigger fish. Maybe we should do that. What what do we have right now? We've got oh no, we've got a bamboo pole. So we don't wanna we don't wanna buy another bamboo pole. That's not gonna do us any good. So anyway guys, I think I'm gonna do some fishing for a little bit and I'll come right back to ya. Alright guys, I am back. So I've got two sardines and uh oh I keep doing that. Wrong button. And I also managed to fish up some seaweed and some broken glasses. So let's go ahead and sell those guys. One of them was three inches long and one of them was one inch. So that gets us a little bit more money to work with. And then if I remember correctly, there was a quest on the bulletin board at the general store for someone who was looking for seaweed. So I'm wondering if I can uh, still accept that quest, and if so, I will do so and uh, trade that in for some some cash, basically. Uh, let's see, store was like right over here? Yeah, here we go. Let's see. So, oh, maybe you... Okay, so it looks like you have to basically accept the quest on the day it appears. Which is a little unfortunate, but I guess it's not the end of the world. Um, let's also take a look. So you got a blacksmith there. I'm trying to see what I haven't discovered yet. We could go to the carpenter shop. Which it looks like that's actually where Demetrius lives as well. So I think we've been there, we just haven't actually like looked around. So let's head there and just kind of see, like, what house upgrades cost and stuff like that. This, I believe, is the carpenter shop right here. Let's just see. Yeah, yeah, Robin's right here. What can I do for you? Shop. So we can buy resources. We can buy furniture and stuff. We can upgrade the house. So 10,450 pieces of wood. And then constructing farm buildings, we can sell, we can do a coop. So all of this stuff is going to be really out of our price range for the time being. Yeah. That's okay though, we can, uh, we can deal with that later. Who are you? Maru! Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru, I've been looking forward to meeting you. You too, Maru, nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. Um... So now we've got what? Two, we're only missing two people. Two townsfolk right now. We found everybody else. Maybe, maybe we'll get lucky and we'll be able to stumble across someone else. I mean, right now everything's raining. So like I'm, I'm assuming most people are going to be home instead of out and about since it's pouring rain. But then again, you never know. Maybe the people of Stardew Valley are, are fine with the rain. Maybe they enjoy it. I don't know. I'm going to look around a bit more, guys. I'll come back to you in just a little bit. All right, guys. I am back, and we're here at the Stardrop Saloon. And it seems like this is a great place to kind of meet people after the day is over. So we've got some of that old ragtime music playing, like you hear in an old Western saloon, which is kind of cool. Sam. I don't think I've spoken with Sam yet. Maybe I have. I don't know. What am I going to do today? I'm just looking around to see if there's anyone here that I haven't uh, been introduced to yet or anything like that. I think I've met everybody, though. No, no time to chat. Yeah, I think all of these people I've, I've met with before. Can I open that? I can. But I don't think I can actually go back here. Oh, maybe I can. Interesting. Okay, so that's where Gus lives, and this just seems to be like a guest... A guest room or something like that. Doesn't look like there's anyone here that uh, I haven't met before, though. So we're still missing one singular person. Just one. I don't know where they are. I don't know who they are. But hopefully we'll stumble across them uh, relatively soon. Although it might be there was that miner that was kind of trapped on the other side of the mine. Uh, that big rock that we found earlier, so maybe that's the guy, and maybe I just can't get to him yet. I don't know. We'll have to find out. But it is getting late, and I think it's time for me to call it a night, and we'll start off the next day fresh. So I'm going to go take a nap, guys, and I'll be back with you in just a moment. All right, guys, I am back. So it's the next morning. Looks like the plants are all still growing, big and strong. Let's go ahead and water them all. 
because we want to make sure we're getting our crops going. And I think these actually should be uh, harvest. They should be harvestable here pretty soon, I think. I'm not sure if they're completely ready to go or not. I mean, I suppose... I don't really want to just, like... I don't think they are yet. Okay. So that's fine. That's fine. I just don't want to, uh... I don't want to, like, tear them up before they're ready and then not have, uh... Not have crops anymore. That would be kind of unfortunate. So let's head into town. I've got some stuff here that I might be able to sell. Which would be good. Oh, what are you? A leek. Okay, cool. Vegetables. Wild vegetables. Very cool. So that's all stuff that I can probably sell for a little bit of cash. Kind of work my way up to that backpack, I'm hoping. Um, anything over here? Not really. Oh, actually. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know what that is. Okay. So anyway, let's head into the general store if I can. I think... I'm still kind of figuring out, like, where everything is in Pelican Town. Oh, and we have a notice. Need a sunfish for my latest project. Yeah, I can totally do that. A sunfish? I, I can totally catch a sunfish for you, Maru. Um, in fact, we've got a little bit of time before the shops open up and stuff like that, so let's, uh, let's go ahead and give that a try. Let's see if we can catch a sunfish for Maru. I wonder if we can just fish right here. Nope, doesn't look like it. Can I fish right here? Yes, I can, cool. Now I wonder if the fish that you can catch changes based on where you're actually fishing. I wonder if you catch different fish, uh, different fish in the ocean than you do in the rivers. That would be kind of cool too. And I'm still not amazing at fishing, but... Oh, stop. There we go, what do we get? Smallmouth bass. That is definitely a different fish that I've caught in the ocean. So maybe you can catch different fish in the rivers than you do... Uh, I think I just missed a, missed a bite there. I think you definitely can catch different fish in the rivers than you do in the oceans, which would make sense. I mean, saltwater, freshwater. Ooh, green algae. Delicious. Hmm. So, sunfish we caught down at the pier. So let's head down and talk with Willy. Uh, I think I'll sell this, this smallmouth bass here. And we'll see if maybe we can get something uh, every time. Every single time. Uh, let's sell the smallmouth bass. And we actually got a decent amount of cash for that. I'm kind of impressed. Let's see. Come on, sunfish. Hopefully we'll catch something good. I think what I'll do... Actually, it's the store is now open, so I'll try and catch a fish here. If I don't catch a smallmouth... All right, not a smallmouth bass. If I don't catch a sunfish here, I'll head to the general store and sell all of this stuff. And if I do, then we'll see what happens. Yep, stay. No, 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 no. Hold still. That one's just staying down there. That was a pretty easy one. A herring. Okay. Well, a herring isn't going to do me any good. We'll sell that guy for some gold as well. We're slowly working our way up to that backpack. I think the backpack was, uh... A thousand? Two thousand? Something like that. We're slowly working our, our way up. And we've got a cockle. We've got, uh... Well, at this point, we have a completely full inventory, so... Let's head to the general store, see what we can sell. Maybe we can sell some good stuff. Let's see, general store is right here. Here we go. All right, Pierre, what will you buy? You'll buy the leek for 60, the daffodils for 30 each, and the horseradish for 50 each. That gets us up to over a thousand, which is awesome for us. But we need 2,000 gold to purchase the next, uh, the backpack. So we're halfway there. Hopefully when we uh, have that turnip crop finish, we'll have enough to buy the upgrade. That would be really good. Who are you? Have I talked with you yet? Penny. Yes. Yes, I have talked with Penny. And I've talked with... You're the... Are you the ditzy blonde that doesn't like me? Yeah, Haley. Organizing her clothes and stuff like that. 
But we've got a little bit, oh, actually the cockle is considered a fish. So I bet I can sell that to Willy as well. Ooh, who are you? Are you new? Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in a little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. So that's actually all of these people. So give someone a gift. Delivery. Oh yes, yeah, we need to catch a sunfish for Maru. But we got that quest completed, so now we need to work on the deliver on, on giving someone a gift, basically. And I think that this is considered a fish? No, it's not. What about this? Is that considered a fish? A mussel, yes. So I bet Willie will buy the cockle and the mussel. We're gonna find out. Let's see here. Willie! Oh, uh, he'll buy the clam too. Okay, so he'll actually buy all that stuff. That's pretty good. Maybe what we should do is just kind of scour the beach for a little bit and see if I can find any more clams or mussels and stuff of that nature. Um, doesn't look like there's anything over there. I don't know what these statues are for either. I'm assuming they serve some purpose. That's the second one I've seen now. But yeah, it looks like that's pretty much all of them. So I'm going to do some more fishing, guys. Try to fish up a sunfish for Maru. I'll be back with you in just a little bit. All right, guys. I am back. And I spent pretty much the whole day fishing. I caught some stuff, but I did not, unfortunately, catch the sunfish that I was looking for. Um, and it's getting late. I think it's time to pretty much call it a night here. But that's okay. We were able to introduce ourselves to all the villagers. And I think tomorrow our crops should be ready, I think, uh, or at least the turnips should be ready. So that's kind of what I'm hoping. I guess we'll find out. There's only one way to know for sure. Um, although I may have lost my way home. Am I lost? Am I horribly and completely and totally lost? Because that would be very unfortunate. Let's see here. Um, new? No, no, no. Oh, fine. Map. Ah, I went too far this direction. That's okay. Wow, it's it's actually like 9 o'clock at night. I need to get some sleep. Or I'm going to be very tired tomorrow morning. We can also... I want to see if I can sell some of the stuff, like the seaweed and... Uh, basically, Mayor Lewis had said, like, when we first got into town, that if there was anything that we didn't want, we should... Like, if anything we wanted to sell, we should put it in our little... Uh, box thing. Let's see, can I just work my way around like this? I think I should be able to. I'm pretty sure I've gone this way before. Maybe? Because this is definitely our house. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So, here we are. So, let's go to our box. And let's just see. I'm going to put the fish in there. I'll put the seaweed... We'll put all of that in there. Actually, no. The fiber I want to keep for myself. And we'll just see if that stuff sells in the morning or uh, what the deal is. But I think that is definitely going to do it for me in this episode, guys. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it, and it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching. And I'll definitely see you next time.